morning. So it's Monday and it's the first day of my first week grad school and yeah, uh, kind of trying to be successful. I am dressed for my workout. <laughs> I'm going to work out this morning. I don't have anything actually on my schedule until later. So I have just plans to do a couple of like administrative tasks this morning and things I have to get done um, like paperwork wise, but I'm kind of, yeah, trying to get this started on the right foot. again so done with my workout for the day yay <laughs> one thing accomplished from today so I have my daily schedule where I have my uh, I personally like to use like an hourly layout and I block off my time in blocks and this really helps keep me on track Rack. So today I have on my schedule to do my workout and then I have to film an intro video for the class that I'm TAing as just like an introduction to me. So I'm going to be filming that. And then I have planned to do some background reading for the research lab that I'm going to be doing rotations in. Um, my research mentor sent out some background journal articles so I'm going to be um, I'm gonna be reading those today this morning and then this afternoon I have a four-hour training for my class that I'm going to be TAing and four hours is a long time but I'm also really excited because I just I'm excited to get more information about the class that I'm going to be TAing specifically. So, yay. I'm going to go take a shower though uh, after that workout and I'll see you later. Hey, so it is 10.34 p.m. The end of my first day of grad school and today was a little bit of nothing, a little bit of meetings, and a little bit of life happening. Um, I had a long meeting about TAing this semester and got some really good information about that. I start as a TA tomorrow, so I'm really excited because now I'm up a little bit later than I wanted to finishing my intro for my grad uh, or for my TAing for tomorrow so hoping to get to sleep here in the next half hour and I yeah I have a busy day tomorrow I actually have my first class and I TA and I have a meeting with my research professor so lots going on tomorrow and I will update you all tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. It's nine o'clock on Tuesday morning. My first day of classes starts today and I'm really excited. I have biochemistry this morning um, at 9 30 and it's a synchronous lecture so we're going to be on zoom for the lecture all together which I'm looking forward to just because I'm hoping it'll give us a chance to like get to see faces and get to know like the students that are in my class and maybe even in my cohort um, and then I have a little bit of a break 
before I meet with my research mentor for this semester and we're going to talk about the research that I'm going to be doing this semester so that's really exciting. Um, getting to know what I'm actually going to be doing in the lab and then this afternoon I get to TA my first class. Today is going to be um, a pretty easy day because it's just like an intro to the class, an intro to me. Obviously I'm a little nervous to start the first day. Sorry, you can hear my dog in the background. <laughs> Max. Um, obviously I'm a little nervous to start my first day, but I'm also excited and I'm excited to get my classes and research and TAing all in one day. So we'll see how it goes. Max. Hey buddy. Say hi. Say hi Max. Max needs a fur cut. <laughs> He's got all his scruff still. about how I'm feeling right now. Um, I had biochemistry this morning and lecture was fine. Um, breakout rooms in Zoom are super awkward. Uh, which like, ugh, I don't know. It's just so weird to like all of a sudden be on camera with three other people and uh, <laughs> then I kind of missed what the professor told us to talk about, so I was a little clueless. <laughs> um, in all fairness, I missed because I was trying to figure out how to screenshot his page that we would need to discuss, and I didn't know how to screenshot. Uh, note to self for like my students is to like maybe not freak them out about having to screenshot something and then go on to my instructions because they probably won't be paying attention like I wasn't. Uh, but yeah, so I just had some lunch and now I have my meeting with my lab professor in about an hour. So I'm going to read some research articles, journal articles until that meeting. Um, yeah. Welcome back to my little corner of my world. <laughs> um, I, anyways, I just had my appointment with my advisor, my research advisor, and it went great. It was really um, pretty simple overview. We just went over, um, like, we have COVID health guidelines, so we went over the COVID health guidelines and a little bit about project expectations, more so like scheduling because it's me um, and a master's student are both working on a project this semester that we aren't working together but we're working on like the same project and we're going to be training together so getting that scheduled. Um, I found out I won't be in the lab this week which is fine. Um, I have to go to campus to get my keys for my office but I won't be in lab um, but I will be doing something for lab so that's exciting um i'm going to be doing primer design for the experiment that i'm going to be doing this week and i have a teensy bit of experience with primer design like teensy so it's going to be a new experience for me but i'm really excited and now i have uh about an hour until i start my taing yay <laughs> I'm getting more nervous as the minutes go by, like, more nervous, but I will say I would be enormous, I would, oh, enormous, I would be nervous, um, if we were in person also, that's just who I am, but I am more nervous to do it on Zoom because I, like, I know the experience of walking into a classroom the first day and so that wouldn't be new, but I have never done this experience of teaching on Zoom. So not only is the experience new, but it's my first day with a new group of students who are also going through their first day of online learning because today is the first day of classes for everybody. So it's just a lot of new.
day two the first day of classes and it was a really long day but a really good day and yeah so tomorrow's a really full day and I hopefully will be able to show you some more of what I'm doing a lot of meetings not a lot of exciting things to show you but I will show you the kind of like ins and outs of it branches out of my back yard. <clears throat> I am going to take a little bit of a moment to clean up my bed. It's kind of gotten a little out of control in the last like day. So yeah, this needs to get cleaned. <laughs> my home. <laughs> I feel like I haven't left this corner of my universe all week and it's only Wednesday and it's been a great week. Um, <laughs> I'm two for three on kids needing to go to the doctor this week uh, so that's fun. 
just part of my life as a mom during grad school. Um, all the kids are fine. Little one's got an ear infection, which is never fun, but, um, and yeah, so other than that, my week has been kind of consumed with grad school and family, and I haven't really had a good chance to take some self-care, so I've got my tea tonight, and I'm gonna, um, savor that as I do some more of these primer designs. Yeah. I'll see you later. Good night. Full of one up. So it is Thursday and I'm sure you can hear my little one snoring. The girls I'm home with my youngest who is uh home sick today. And yeah, luckily I have a, a light day today. So I'm going to attend my Zoom lecture, um, and that's actually all I have uh, to actually do today. So it's just going to be lots of cuddles, and yeah, for me, uh, being a mom is always going to come first, and um, I wouldn't have it any other way. It just means that I get to be creative in how I make sure I achieve my other goals in life. Uh, and today that means taking a, a personal day and getting lots of snuggles. And so I probably won't vlog much today just because it's going to be me hanging out with the kiddo. And yeah, but I'll, I'll see you tomorrow. I didn't film yesterday because my son was up all night and was sick. And I was struggling to get the door unlocked today. Um, while I was in the grocery store with him, you know, getting back on track when he had knocked me out. Um, so like, my mom beat him in, and the following day. Soon as something rose me up or hit me, then I struggled, and I know struggling, struggling helps me try to get back back into it, and um, I'm struggling today, and I'm struggling because like I had a lot on my to-do list yesterday that I didn't get done, and I'm feeling overwhelmed, um, so. I haven't watched my video and I've been overwhelmed. I'll link it here. Um, because, yeah, I'm going to use that as the link. I'll just kind of start doing something now and see where it takes me and then try and get through this week and done so that I can feel like I'm getting back on the right track. afternoon <laughs> and my week is basically done. I just finished my last meeting of the week with my research mentor for the semester and it was a really good meeting. Um, went over my primer designs that I finished and also set up times for me to be in the lab next week. Yay! 
I am really excited to get in the lab. Um, yeah, and I'm just feeling good. I'm feeling a lot better than I was this morning. So yeah, this afternoon I'm just gonna finish doing some work.